Zen, Zen masters, without thinking, just instantly say something. <laughs> Instant coffee. The frog, ancient pond, the frog jumps. Plop. <laughs> and such was the beauty of the Japanese poems. Nakin Master was one among them who shook the whole world with his instant dialogues, instant course. It just happens not only to Hakin Master, to anybody who is empty. In emptiness, truth prevails. Hakin Master, this is the fourth quote. All beings are by nature Buddhas. As ice by nature is water. Apart from water, there is no ice. Apart from beings, no Buddhas. Just reminding you, everybody is a Buddha. Buddha means enlightened. And everybody is rushing out to practice, out to become enlightened in several of the ashrams, several of the monasteries, sitting in cross leg, and that has become the poverty of the land. When you go to learn, you created the first step of destruction of you and your family. When you don't go to learn, and learning happens of its own, that's why in India, the Karma Yoga has become so powerful that you keep doing your work without expecting anything in return. There is no material gains at all. Neither a material gain enters your head. It is just your strength you feel of just sharing. All beings are by nature Buddhas. Yes, all beings, including the trees, the animals, the earth, everything. If you feel they are doing the work. If a rose is a rose, is a rose, is a rose, a lily is a lily, is a lily is a lily. When a rose tries to become a lily, that's where the problem starts. All oh. then the lily goes to to the universities, to the schools, to the monasteries, to the ashrams or to Samajis like us to learn how to become a rose. Finished. You are a beautiful lily. And when you bloom, yes, you bloom with your happiness and you create happiness all around or happiness follows you, yes. All beings of nature are Buddhas, as ice by nature is water, ice by nature is water. Apart from water, there is no ice, it looks solid because in Karma Yoga, we keep teaching them, burn it in the highest temperature. You should burn in the highest temperature. You should sweat at least seven times a day or seven times you should sweat before you can even say you have started that work on that particular day. It means you have started your happiness. You have started licking your happiness. You have started uh, understanding the quality of yours. You became conscious. You are not unconscious. You are removing all the unconscious things which has entered your body free of cost or by forced ideology. When you remove that one, wow, holy consciousness. And in that consciousness, when you melt it, it is what? And nobody can possess the what? Water can penetrate any hardest substance in the whole world. But you look hard when you are in the eyes. Major part of the people, they, when you ask them to work, Passionately, they don't work. They work to look into the time. They work whether to find out whether we are squeezing the energy out. So many borrowed knowledges are disturbing them. So the moment they see the smoke a bit, a clap from people, or a Nobel Prize, or an Arjuna Award, a clap from a from the people, from the donkeys, you see the smoke and you thought, ah, I am the fire. No, 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 no. The smoke 
the moment the smoke comes the moment you get the clap you have to walk again 100 times faster and powerfully and then the smoke moves out and you see the fire you are the fire yes which has melted and it became water and water can penetrate when majority of the people forgot and they stood before the smoke and hence there is a poverty in the land hence they are living in fear and fear gives you a noble price called disease it drags you into a mansion a beautiful palace called hospital or into the monasteries temples churches masjid ashrams like us look into you yes enjoy yes when you enjoy you start looking into you every part of your body all beings of the nature of buddha you are a buddha enlightened being born an enlightened being your smile was so innocent yes your ideas flows with innocence because there is only truth there is no books no need of any books or universities you don't even have to do a phd you do not have to research the search was all in there there's no need to even to search to do a research because people are going to do research because they are unconscious they wanted a clap they wanted a, a something in front of their name as near na- ice by nature is water yes apart from water there's no ice break that ice break the and then you can flow nobody has given a name brahmana shatra vaishya shatra for the ice maybe in languages they say water in english in kannada they say neeru and telugu they say neelu in hindi they say pani in japanese they say miso words changes but the system is the same you don't get trapped by the different names apart from beings no buddhas